Hi, this is Dwight with Apogee. Um, I'm the president of Apogee, and we are business partners with NIADA and Auto Search Technologies. We're the tech company behind those those businesses, and we've been providing solutions for car dealerships for over 10 years now. Uh, thousands of car dealerships run on our technology. I'm here with our executive officer and CEO, Joe Frazier. Hi, this is Joe Frazier. Thank you, Dwight. Um, we're going to have Dwight go through this demo here in just a second, but I just wanted to mention to everybody that I appreciate you for taking the time to watch this demo. Um, please don't hesitate to give us a call if you have any questions. We are more than happy to help you make the right decision for your business. Um, and we gladly integrate with your GMS company, with your merchant account provider. Um, we, we do our best to make this easy and painless for you. Okay, go ahead, Dwight. Thanks, Joe. So what is iPay Auto? Well, primarily it's a, a payment solution for auto dealers. And it allows you to get paid online from anywhere. So your customers who, who may have uh, purchased loans from you um, via buy here, pay here business model, or maybe they owe you money for service contracts that you've you performed for them, they can pay you from their cell phone, from their tablet, from their laptop computer, on the go, from anywhere. This makes it super easy for them to pay you, which means that you get paid more often. And then on the back end, once you receive those payments, as Joe mentioned, we're going to make sure that it connects to your bank account so the money ends up right in your bank account through your merchant account. And we're also going to connect to your financial software, whether that's QuickBooks or a DMS software. Uh, we're, we're happy to make those connections, and that's no extra cost to, uh, to connect to one of those um, with this simple, easy-to-use product. So I pay auto. Let's take a dive in here and, and look at what it really is. It's on its front. It's a uh, payment portal. So you can, a, as a customer, you can come onto this page. It will adapt to any screen size. So that it's easy to use, and you don't need to zoom in and zoom out or, or squint your eyes looking for something. This is a fully responsive website. That means that it, it fits on any screen size, all the way down to a small smartphone. And it allows them to make a payment. As you scroll down this page, you can see, as a customer, I can come on here and I can enter my, my billing information and make that payment. I can choose how much to pay. I can choose an account number and any other comments that may be necessary there, but really simple on the front because we want this to be quick and painless. And speaking of quick and painless, it's actually even easier if they're returning for the second time because they can easily log in. So I'm going to log in here as if I was a customer coming back for the second time. And now you can see what happened is I'm now logged in and it filled out everything for me. So if a customer is returning to you, they're already going to have their credit card forward on the system, and it's as easy as clicking on that make a payment button after uh, agreeing to the, your terms and conditions. Now, we're storing the credit card data very securely on our servers. Uh, this is PCI compliant, compliant software. That means payment card industry. Visa and MasterCard have given us their, uh, their stamp of approval for being uh, compliant with industry standards and regulations for storing credit cards in the most secure possible way. We're, we're encrypting the data and following a, a number of other rules, including third-party scans, to make sure that that data is secure. I know that that stuff hits the headlines a lot. When credit cards are stolen, I just want to let you know that we are securing that at the highest level possible. Okay, so as a a, uh, a customer, I can come in here, I can make a payment, I can choose how much I want to pay, and uh, let's say I want to pay uh, a $340 payment right there, and I want to put this for account number one, two, three, four, five, six. I think I put in two threes there, and you can make a comment 
this is a comment from the customer. Agree to the terms and conditions and make that payment. Oh, I missed a field. So we have a, a variety of error messages that allow them to um, understand why there may be problems if they're entering their credit card information and, 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 and they miss something. So it's easy to use and really user friendly for um, mistakes that are being made. So they don't have to call you up and, and uh, deal with any of the hassles there of trying to get their credit card information to you over the phone or drive down to your, your dealership um, and, and make corrections if they're worth some. They can do it right here on the fly. What I'm going to do, though, uh, the payment system is very straightforward. As a customer, I can go in there and I can view my payments, but I want to show you real quickly what it looks like for the administrator as well. So if I am an administrator, uh, I would log in. I'm just going to log in here as an administrator. There we go. All right. Now, the administrative dashboard has a lot more buttons than a a customer dashboard would. The customers can only see their own orders, where the administrators can see everyone's orders and additional settings. So one of the things that administrators can do is they can go in and view all of the orders from all of their customers in this nice, simple list. We've got some tags over here on the right. So I can see all of the orders that have authorized and captured. And that just means that the payment has actually been authorized. and the the financial uh, monies have been debited from their credit card into your bank account. So that's a full process. If I wanted to remove that tag, it's as easy as clicking on an X there. None of them have been captured without authorized. Okay. So if I want to see any of them that may have uh, an error tag type, I can easily click on that. You can see now I have that error tag, and I can see exactly which orders have an error on here, and I can jump right into them. Let's jump into this, this order. Um, now, as I'm looking down through the order, I can see the, the total that was attempted to be purchased in this case, billing address, shipping address, and even the system log, which will show additional advanced information from the credit card processor. That's your, your merchant account that connects between this website and your bank. They will show additional information here if there are specifics on why the, um, on why the order was not processed. So it's really good for customer service. And speaking of customer service, I want to show you an additional spot here in the dashboard. We call it the customer service portal. So if you have someone there at your dealership that is in charge of making sure that payments are, are managed and collected, they can easily jump into here. Let's say they want to look somebody up. They, they give a call and they say, um, I want to know, you know if I made the correct amount of payment. And my name is Demo. So the first name is Demo. We can just do a quick search there. You can see, OK, here it is down here. They found, we found one person with the name Demo. And just clicking on that opens their, them up. So you can see their billing information, shipping information, credit card information. Your customer service person can verify that type of thing over the phone and even make changes right here in the system if they want to. We can see exactly how many of these credit card uh, transactions were processed versus error. And you can see the orders that took place under that particular person named Demo in this case. Their billing profile, this is the, where the credit card is stored. So all of this data is easy to access and easy to manage for your staff at your dealership. One more thing I want to show you here before we, in this demo, I want to keep it nice and simple for you, is the fact that when you go back to your, um, your payment page on the front office, you're still going to be logged in, and you can see that by this top bar that follows you around, gives you some additional uh, options from anywhere. But when you're logged in, you can do some really neat things here. You can actually edit the um, 
the messages that pop up for your customers. So if instead of account number, instead you have VIN number as what you want people to enter in order to reference their account, you can say enter your VIN here, please, and save that. Now when somebody clicks into this account number field, they're going to see enter your VIN here, please. So that, that's a really nice customization that you can do as a dealership. In addition, this whole right side is very editable. So you can actually make all sorts of changes over here. You can uh, change the text, the images, and there's a variety of different formatting options that you might find in, in a word processing program like Microsoft Word. Just really easy to use. And if I wanted to say, drag an image into there. I can easily do that um, and make those types of changes on the fly. So without jumping too much into the editing abilities, I want you to know that this whole right side is very editable and you can even edit this section above the form field as well. So you can make changes throughout this, this form page and still have it be a full responsive payment page that can be accessed on any device. Well, what we're going to do as soon as we engage with you and your team, as soon as uh, you fill out the form that you should find on your right hand side, you will uh, be contacted by one of our team members and within a few business days what we're going to do is we're going to install a version of iPay Auto for you with your logo at the top and we are going to insert your terms and conditions right in here. And then we're going to get to work immediately on connecting to your merchant account so that all of the funds transacted through this can end up in your bank account. Um, and you probably already have one of those if you accept credit cards there at a point of sale spot on your, uh, at your dealership. So it should be pretty easy to connect to that with no additional fees. Um, and then also we're going to, as Joe mentioned at the beginning of this call, connect to your financial software. So that's a big advantage for you. If you didn't even want to log into the site to manage any of these orders, you wouldn't have to if, if you wanted us to push that data and make a deep integration over to wherever you uh, have your orders or payments take place. That may be QuickBooks. That may be your DMS software there, dealership, or dealer management system. Here's a couple of examples of some of our our dealerships that are using this. You can see Team Easy Auto. They have their logo at the top. And um, they say, we cannot accept prepaid cards over here. So some, some specific notes for their dealership. Here we have you save car and truck rental. They say, contact your credit card company for attempting to make payment. And they also talk about prepaid cards over here. And here's JR's auto sales. They talk about after hours payments and things like that. So very easy to customize for you. You could even enter a video over here on this right hand side if you wanted to. It's very customizable. So really simple, easy to use, low cost solution for accepting payments and making sure that that financial data gets where you want and that the uh, customer service at your dealership has easy access to that financial data if need be. Okay, I think that should wrap it up. We just want to make a quick simple tour with the product. If you have any questions, please feel free to call us, but uh, we'd love for, for you to join us in our uh, growing family of iPay Auto users. It's a really simple product, easy to use, low cost, and we're finding that it's very popular among car dealerships across the country. So fill out the form on the right and we'll get started right away. Looking forward to working with everybody, and thank you for taking the time to watch this demo today. Please give us a ring if you have any questions. Um, that's at 208-413-9641. That's 208-413-9641. Hope to speak with you soon. Or go ahead and fill out that form. We'll just get you going right away. Take care.